got the family loaded up. The beautiful wife. She's got little baby Willow in there. <laughs> My boy back there watching TV. The entertainment system in these Wagoneers are, I mean, it's hands down the best one I've ever used. You can put it on up here for rear seat entertainment. You can watch TV while you're driving. It shows both TVs in the rear, what, what's on them, what's playing. And you can hit listen in and watch and watch it right here while you're driving. You can also watch it on this screen over here. But really good family vehicle. I mean, it's excellent. So we went and picked this up last night. Towed it with the wagon here. Done phenomenal. Um, I put the tow haul mode on after we picked it up. We had drove down here previously with just a trailer. And I figured out that just leaving it in automatic mode on the arrow setting works a whole lot better. Uh, I kind of talk about that in the other part of the video. But you can see we don't have the tow package. We've just got the regular... Um, I think it's 392s or what's in it but you know you you've got your connections and everything you just don't have a trailer brake so basically i'm just using the brakes of the vehicle this is probably 5,000 pounds altogether trailer in the side by side but i wouldn't want to go over six seven thousand pounds towing with one of these uh even with a trailer brake it just you know it just uh the 57 e-torque has decent power um but it's not very torquey i guess is what i'm trying to get at uh, especially coming from a diesel so we've hit a lot of congested traffic in um, multiple places had to slow down stop uh, we got fuel once but basically the best thing i've found is if you're just towing a trailer that's two to three thousand pounds is to leave it out of tow mode and just put it in normal drive auto and leave your air suspension on the second setting the aerodynamic setting and uh, we've been averaging about 15 to 15 5 now we're at 14 9 but we've been in congested really slow traffic down to 20 and 30 and 15 a bunch We're about 34 miles in, getting 15.5. Just started this once we got on the parkway, but um, the trailer we're towing is about 23 to 2600 pounds, and we're traveling down to get a 2022 Can-Am Defender Max Limited. And we're going to tow it back. It's about 200 and some to 300 miles where we're going. We're going to see how, what kind of fuel mileage we get in the, in the Wagoneer. It has the uh, 5.7 e-torque Hemi. Drives really, really well. Love how this thing tows. I mean, I have an F-250. It's not comparable in torque or anything, but it rides and drives extremely well. 